What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We are here for the Torch Drift beta. There has an update been released and uh, some of the things on this update list are pretty uh, pretty awesome. Uh, they changed the higher range of horsepower at higher levels. They uh, you know added some new sponsors, dynamic cameras. They you know changed the paint shop a little bit. Rewards and sponsors were changed. They fixed some audio issues as well as fixed like the manual, fix the loot from the crates when buying crates, and uh, you know some of the uh, other uh, issues that were, you know, going on with the game. So they have done a lot of updating to this game. So we're gonna go into the game and uh, take a look at some of these updates because I did notice some other things when I was looking at this, and um, a lot of them are pretty sweet. So we're going to take a look into this two hundred and basically 25,000 sessions played. So they didn't reset our accounts, which is a good thing because I was worried they were going to reset the accounts because, you know, I was pretty up there with my cars. But if you notice in the background, one of the biggest changes I've noticed is, well, not biggest changes. If you have the uh, high-end tires, they now have the Nexon logos on the tires, which is pretty sweet to actually see on these cars. So... My car is now over a thousand horsepower and a pro level, which is really nice. So it is, uh, it is definitely, we're going to adjust my audio because I feel like my audio was a little bit too high and it was peaking. So it's definitely nice that it has, uh, gotten up over pro level with, uh, over a thousand horsepower in this rotary looking to get it changed more power here soon. But so that's one change I've noticed. Another change that I have noticed is, uh, well, obviously they got some more sponsors. They got each, they got HGK over there. They got um, Fly One, JDM of California. Um, but I did actually get my Rad Dan sponsorship. I remember if you guys were watching a previous video, I was trying to get the sponsorship. I did get it. Now with uh, my car being a pro car, they also have uh, Gad tires. So there's a lot of new sponsors on here, a lot of cool things. Now, one of the things that I did uh, did notice, we're gonna go to Hakone to uh, show you this. Um, I don't know if it came in this update or if it was on a um, previous update, but I never caught it. Um, as you can see, 1137 horsepower, pro level car, E30 rotary. So one thing I did notice is, uh, take a look at the bottom. We have five gears now. Before we only had four, and now we have five. So I don't know if that was uh, just added in the recent, or if it was because I have a different um, level car now that uh, has, with the different clutch and everything, gave me that fifth gear since Saw Pro. I am not sure. I have to actually look into it a little more, but as you can see, I was able to get my Rad Dan with this car closer to the top of the mountain because we did uh, some really long high speed drifting which I'm going to take this car up the mountain and uh, just uh, give it a little rip rip up here before we maybe get into some tandems because I'm trying to get the uh, JDM Cal of California sponsorship which is uh, 10 30 meter door dives on a cone and I believe we have a cone skyline here so we're going to get into some tandems Ooh, that was right on the wall get on to uh, super cone tandems and trying to uh, finish off that I believe I have five or six so this car definitely could drift this entire course I feel like we should not have lost our uh, points to that but so this car is running extremely well now and if you notice my FPS is uh, really high up there even though I'm recording they uh, did some uh, smoothing out of the game it looks like so my frame rate has definitely uh, substantially gotten better from uh, prior episodes because you guys know when I record my frame rate kind of drops a little bit but uh it's not really dropping right now that was right on that wall I'm having so much fun in this E30 just ripping up this mountain one thing I don't like is the whole audio drop chain when you uh are up there on the high uh, drift level how it like muffles it when you're at really high uh points we're gonna drop that clutch a little bit and kick it up the hill 
car has plenty of power to uh, shred up this hill. So I want to get to the section where I was able to complete the uh, Rad Dan um, sponsorship. Not here. Just tap really hard on this brake. And we lost our door. We don't need the door. Open air. We're good. Oh, no, I didn't lose the door. Must have lost my bumper. So, if you guys are still playing this, I know there's a lot of people saying that they can't get it, they can't re-download it, and, or when they download it, you know, won't let them play or anything like that, because beta is closed. So, they aren't allowing any other people into the beta. So, this is up here is where I got my uh, Red Dan sponsorship, was on these uh, higher speed sections. So, but like I said, if you have it and you were a part of it, you can continue to play it still. But they are not allowing other people to uh, come into the beta. The beta is officially closed. So, that is probably why some people who had it and had to re-download it or whatnot uh, lost the ability to play. See, we're just ripping this section, but I tapped the wall too much. But see, this car has so much power that it can rip these high-speed sections with the fifth gear which is really nice and I didn't notice fifth gear before I could only go in the fourth so I don't know if it's a new thing or if it's maybe because it's a pro level car now but it just can rip these higher speed sections and just hold massive amounts of angle oh uh, got a little bit of an issue when uh, I got that uh, that Facebook notifications get wrecked or uh, Instagram like notifications but so definitely having this car with all this power is nice I do love seeing those um, Nexons spinning around on these tires because it, it gives it a bit of a, a different a different aspect of it. it looks sweet so I did get my Rad Dan if you guys are following the channel you guys know I was trying to get that so I did get that we're gonna go back to the main menu and we're gonna try to get some more door dives at Hakone if we can so we're going to enter into Skyline and try and get some of the uh, door dives and try to get that sponsorship done. I wish it was Tunnel Edge. A lot easier to get some at Tunnel Edge, but we are here. Ooh, so 13 Devils looking Link. All right. Looks like he's got a pretty sweet S15 paint. So we're going to see if we can't get a good run here. going to pop this thing all the way right in the fifth gear because it has the power. Kick it in and not how I wanted to kick it in at all. So that's not a good start to uh, this run. We're going to try and save the latter part of the track as much as we can. So I don't think that's going to be high enough that he's probably going to have a hundred and some thousand because it looks like his, uh, his car's pretty dialed from what it looks like. But then again, you could have crashed. So we will see not too high off of us. So we could probably get him in this chase. They have changed the cut screens too. In between loading screens have been changed as well. There's a lot of cool ones. So that's another change that I have noticed. So let me see if we can get some door dives. I probably initiated super late compared to him, but he's all over the track. Okay. So that's not going to help us get our door dives and uh now because i can't see where he's at now i'm way behind and not going to be able to catch him on the chase which means i don't think i'm going to be able to get the win because i am way far off him now not even getting anything and he's wondering oh he died that man just died D -I -E. died we did lose because we couldn't get a chase because he wrecked so it's kind of sad, um, but you know, is what it is. It's the name of the game. So we're gonna try and give him a rematch on him and see because it, it's not a it's not a bot, it's an actual car. He's gonna take our rematch. So hopefully we can get a better lead run and um, we'll see what happens this time. We're gonna try and rematch him. So I went to go face him for a second time and my phone decided to crash. Look at that mad mic getting chased by Dean Kearney. So it crashed for some reason, so we're back here at Hakone trying to find another race. So if you guys are still enjoying the Drift Beta videos, let me know down in the comment section down below. Big thank you to the game devs of Torque Drift for allowing me to bring the content out and uh, working my way from the ground up here. 
Uh, let's see, we're going against a pretty, pretty awesome looking Supra. Working my way from the ground up from the cars with all the count um, resets and everything, you know, grinding it out. It's definitely been a lot of fun. We're going to pick this in sooner. There we go. It's definitely a lot of fun to play this game. That's going to be a hard hit. Why? So, I don't understand why when I'm trying to uh, do tandems, I have some sort of frame rate lag. But when I'm driving normally, I have absolutely no frame rate lag whatsoever. So it's kind of a kind of a sad thing because I wanted to get some good tandems. But I don't understand why when I'm recording and I do tandems, I get frame rate lag. But when I'm not, I don't. So it's only but if I drive by myself it happens. So it's gotta just be a characteristic of it. So we're gonna see if we can't get some door dives because that, that's the whole purpose up here on the cone is to get 30 meter door dive. I don't think that's going to work as a door dive. That, I mean that was a very uh, solid door smack. It wasn't really a door dive per se but we did beat him in the lead. And he stopped. We probably could have gotten it and then he wrecks it in the wall. So that man took him out took himself out so hopefully we still get the win i mean i'm not sure just barely barely took a win but it is a win so we will take it as you can see the back of the dynamic camera looking a bit uh looking a bit different rotating around the car and it's a little glitchy i think but you know still kind of a cool camera view so we're gonna go to the next battle try to get another tandem run here we might switch up to uh, the slab and try and get some uh, runs at the slab. Just to, you know, try and get some good tandems for today's episode. So you guys know you guys can follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. All of which are found in the description box below. Searching for opponents. Let's, uh, let's go. Waiting. Somebody want to go? Or did uh, this event just end on me? And since I did next, it's not finding anybody because nobody can go into it. So we can go back to the events page. No, it's still there. Well, we'll hit up, we'll hit up the slab, run the slab run, see uh, if we can get some tandems in the slab, because they did fix the uh, slab now. Because before you could not actually uh, get a run, like it would never find anybody. And it was only the slab that did it, which was unfortunate because the slab's a fun track. Who are we going against? Dark Star 820. Looks a little bit like James Dean. And uh, 1200 horsepower. So this should be a very interesting matchup. If we can uh, come out on top, it'll be good. It looks like he's got a very, uh, very good car, so we should be able to get a good chase on him as long as we can make ourselves with a good lead. Oh, so lucky we kept our points there. This is actually a very good run so far. I should downshift in the fourth, but hopefully we can keep it in fifth. I have to kick that back a lot. Oh, just a tap. But I guess I will take it because that's a very high run. I don't think I've ever gotten a run this high. That's a slab. They added those walls for those nice wall rides on this section and uh we just outed him he had a good lead run as well so this is going to be a good battle it's going to be a close battle so hopefully we can uh we can get a good chase and stay on his door and uh you know get a solid point run Oof. that was a very weird entry but we will take it we are still gaining our tandem points He's uh, kind of pulling on us though, and that's our losing points there. We're going to downshift in the fourth in this section. I'm going to try to cut the line a little bit just to gain some proximity so I don't completely lose him. And he is really running that S14 pretty well. So 28, 29,000. This is going to be a close match. Hopefully, we came out. Oh, wow. Nope. See, he had a way better chase run than we did. So, that was a good matchup. I wonder if I can get, a, get against him again. That was a very good run. 
So there's a lot of good drivers out now, a lot of good people that uh, can lay down some solid runs. I'm going to try to get a rematch with this man because uh, he threw it down, so it would be nice to try to get another run because he's, he's not a body, he's an actual player, so he probably is saving his recording because he probably had a bomb chase. We uh, failed on the chase, we did on the lead, but we failed on the chase, and so we did lose that. What? Is he going to... Oh, he left. Get wrecked. That's unfortunate. So I did find it kind of cool that that picture of Daishihara's car is uh, got the camera on top, right there. Camera on top, just like FD. Uh, looks like it's at um, Streets of Long Beach. That track looks like from that little clip. So let's see if we can find somebody at Hakone and maybe try and get another door dive for that sponsorship. Cause uh, I'm trying to get those done. And it's that Supra again. Oh boy. So hopefully we can do better against the Supra this time. Throw in the fifth. I know I probably should have stayed in fourth, but try this in fifth. That's a lot of angle. And lost it out. So I'm downshift in the fourth and try and somewhat salvage this run because this is a very bad run way off of every single clip so that just made me look like a total amateur <laughs> here on the cone but still gonna chase him down try to get those door dives I've come to the point where if I lose now it's not a big deal I'm just trying to get those door dives so I still try to run a solid chase or a solid lead run so that they have a nice chaseable run as well but sometimes uh, you get bested by that and then there's that happening my car's starting to be a little bit more skeetier than I thought it was going to I don't know if maybe uh, it just has something to do with uh, the setup now it never is really good on this skyline circuit it's good on the uh, I smacked that dude's door it's good on the tunnel edge run but not so much here on the um, Skyline circuit. I think it's because I'm trying to really get on his door. I lost my lot. He took me out completely. I'm trying to get on his door, so I'm trying to initiate different lines, which is actually probably screwing me up instead of initiating on my normal line. So we're gonna go to Ocean Drive, Desert Palm, Volunteer, because I believe I do have some door dives at Ocean Palm for another sponsorship that I have to get to. But I totally forgot which one it is, and I forgot how long it was. So. Maybe we'll find out, and, uh, well, we'll see what happens, if we can find somebody to go against us. There's not a lot of people playing right now. I think it's because a lot of people lost their betas, and it looks like a HGK uh, E46. So, uh, let's we'll see what we can do here. And a little, little glitchy lag there. But we will make it work. Try not. Ooh, I mean, we can try and run that wall line. Try and transition back this way. Let's get up in that line. There we go. It's actually, not a very bad lead run, except for right there. Just a tap. Just, just, just a very big tap. 75, 094 for us. My initiation was very sloppy, but um, we will. Uh, Take a higher, higher score on our lead. So we're gonna try and get a chase done, and uh, see how this goes. I think this is probably be the last run for today's episode. So you guys know you can follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, Instagram. All the found in the description box below. I do appreciate all the support from everybody, especially on this torque drift season series, whatever you want to call it, that I have been doing on the channel. Ooh. I'm so glad he goes through me. When he's behind me. He did the same thing I did. So I feel like we'll take that win. So you guys know I do appreciate all the support, all the comments, and everything that you guys uh, do on the channel. So we did take that. So as always, uh, thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit, and I was really, really awesome. Oh, we blew apart when we went through. It's so, so weird not having a driver. So. Until next time, 
Thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'm out.